Welcome to this vlog. We are at the National Museum of Kenya. That is the Museum of Kenya there. So I just want to get in, explore, tell you the charges, show you what is there. So it's located on Museum Hill. Me straight to Zoom. Yes, the Museum Hill Centre. So if you're coming here, you take a matatu that is going to Westlands or Parklands and then a light just in front of the National Museum. Just tell them you want to alight at the National Museum. It's 30 shillings from the CBD, that is 0 0.03 dollars. Let's get in, show you how the beautiful the Museum of Kenya is, okay? Yeah. My daughter is saying that, that those people are naked. <laughs> but this is the compound. Look at how beautiful it is. So you come, you pay at the gate. No. Look at that's a dinosaur so beautiful so you come and then you register at the gate after registering Ooh. and then you walk now you've been told to come and pay over there look at how beautiful this oh my goodness oh my god i don't understand why i've never been here i normally just pass by like check see the beauty wow, wow. and this is kenya wow imagine this is kenya and it is very very cheap i don't want to tell you the price now because i saw online it was 200 bob for adults but let's first get in and then <laughs> who's excited let's first get in and then i'll show you tell you the charges for sure for sure after i've paid for it mama hi are you happy you want to see all these beautiful things Ooh. This is going to be a good day. Yeah. <laughs> so we are inside guys. So the Nairobi National Museum consists of two parts. The museum itself and the snake park. So I'm not going to go to the snake park section. No. I'm here to enjoy the museum. So the charges are 200 for adults, 100 for kids below 16 years. That is for the museum and then for snake park i'll confirm again but they should be around 150 bob so let's show you the national museum of kenya <laughs> so this is the first part you come across you come to it looks like sort of a reception or star so we are outside the museum we have not yet gone into the museum yet so that's what we want to do let's start with maybe one way okay so you see the kind of things that are here. This is the kiondo, the traditional kikuyu kiondo. If you are kikuyu, you are familiar with this. And these are the gourds. These are the gourds. Oh my goodness. Like, you see, they've made this beautiful thing out of gourds. And then these are birds. Let me show you the birds. Wow. So, <laughs> who is kissing birds? So these are birds. These are feathers and stuff. The motoni. Motoni is a headdress made by Maasai youths, preferably from big and colorful birds. Before a youth is circumcised, he wanders about the countryside with his friends catching birds for his headdress. After circumcision, he waits for about eight days and goes out to catch some more birds. Oh! Like, and then there is this. This is Abu. Eh! Oh my goodness. You know, these are the things you just learn about in, like, in school. The Abu is a musical instrument used by the Luo community. It's a combination of guards leading to a horn at the tip. Yes, this is what they used to normally blow the horns. Wow. So we have these. These are butterflies. How pretty are these butterflies? Oh my goodness. You see? This is the Sambu. 
Sambu is a cloak made from the skins of the Sykes monkey. Wow! And this, this is like a monkey monkey. Can you see this a monkey? See that? You can see the monkey. So now let's get into the museum. Because as I told you, this is nice, like the outer part. So the first part of the museum we're getting into is called the Great Hall of Mammals. So I assume this is where, oh my goodness, so beautiful. I assume this is where the mammals are. Oh my goodness, look at this baby running. Wow. Hello, Mr. Elephant. This is an elephant, isn't there? That's a zebra. Oh my God. Hmm? This is a zebra. You love it so tall. Mommy say tall. <laughs> it's so long. <laughs> and then what is this, Mama? Wow. What is this? This is a buffalo. Buffalo. Written, please. Don't touch the animals. So, this is how it looks like. Yes, wait, mom. We'll see the lands. So, this is how this place looks like. So, come, let's look at them one by one, mama. Which animals are these? The spiny mouse. Wow, this is a spiny mouse. This is out. Uh, what is this, mom? What is this? It's a porcupine. lions look at that look at that <laughs> which animal is this the caracol caracol is a cat yeah it looks like a cat that specializes in eating birds huh although it also eats small mammals so that's it who do we have here cat cat family <laughs> this is a leopard. Mama, this is a leopard. And then, several cat. I never knew there was such a thing. A carnival, a carnivorous cat eating on birds. Wow. So this is that. Several cat. This is the hyena. Team Mafisi. Representing Team Mafisi over there. <laughs> then come Mama. This is the mongoose. This is the mongoose. Oh, the flash keeps showing. Here, we have dim light, so I'm using my phone's camera flash. So if you see it, don't don't mind so much. I'm walking alone. The streets are empty. The only thing I can see is my own silhouette. Getting stronger, step by step. The clock is ticking, but there's no time for me. I've been flying from town to town. This is the skull of an elephant. It's so big, yo guys. Have you ever seen such a big skull? Mountain gorilla. Oh my goodness. This is a cheetah. The other one was a leopard, and this is a cheetah. <laughs> wow, here's our hippo. It's so big. And then on top, there's a donkey. So the next exhibition is the CBK New Mismatic Exhibition. I think this is like a history book sort of thing wow so these are the central bank of kenya's governors for the past 50 years i think it's just the history of the central bank is it 
over there the history of the central bank this is the evolution of the currency in kenya wow so these are the currencies that we, we had okay. my daughter just wants to look at animals only she doesn't care about the history but you see king george the sixth so these are the currencies so whichever currency you want to get their history this is the currency of uh, queen elizabeth so these are the various currencies we had of Queen Elizabeth. And then these here, these are all currencies. This is money, 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 all over, up to the ceiling, up to the ceiling, up to this other way. It's just money, currencies. My daughter just likes paintings and animals. Oh my goodness. So over here we have paintings. Okay. Elephant tusk. Wow. This is a water pot called Isiunga. Wow. This is a hole. <laughs> oh, yeah, the H-O-E. <laughs> so... This is what we have over here. These are good. Wow, we can read good. So we are going to another area of the museum. Oh, this place is so big. Like, There's this person that is exciting my daughter so much. <laughs> she's laughing at the fact that we behind. I think she's saying these people are naked. <laughs> Skeletons again. Oh, so we're doing upstairs. of the museum is it's that dim light so there's so much history 
in this place there's so much about our traditions of Kenyans and Africans in general and even other parts of the world that I don't even think you can consume it in one day. These are places that you can tour and have fun at very cheap cost, like 200, that's it's cheap. This is the view from up here. Every time we say goodbye They all see that it's a lie Cause we always give it one last try Yeah, you've watched me break a thousand times Now I'm all alone Cause you never show You say you will But then you don't That's how it goes So we just finished with the National Museum, so we just want to enjoy the compound just a little bit and then go home. So what I've realized is that they don't allow you to come in with stuff. They, they tell you to leave your snacks or water when you're getting in, so that's what you do. If you come here, number one, <laughs> if you're coming with a kid, let them eat. My daughter ate to her feel, but halfway she's like, I'm hungry. So you, they get hungry, once they get hungry, they don't concentrate on anything. So just going to get her snacks so she can eat. <laughs> if you're planning on taking photos, please come with someone who can help you do that. Because hey, it was hectic for me, yes, I had my tripod, but the small one, Taraji took, she had to take photos of me today. And she took amazing photos, which is surprising. There is so much here, I don't even think we've explored all of it. So down there is the snake park. We are not going there. Not at all. If you're interested in the snake park, you come. I've shown you the charges. You come look at the snake park. So, we are just going home. We're done. There's one place we didn't look. The craft shop over there at the end. But we've looked at lots of craft. Okay, there's actually very many craft shops, you see. Over here. It's not just one place. So, this is the Nairobi. National, this is the Nairobi National Museum. We had a good experience. Mm.